What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's Chris Etio, and we got a chance to play Jane and Seth early before their actual release. Thanks to the story mode in version 1.1. I wanted to wait a little bit before making this video, just so I'm not, I wasn't spoiling anyone who may or may not have uh, played the story so far. But if you have played the story, then yes, we were able to go ahead and play Jane Doe and Seth on the same team and see just how good of a duo these two are together. That we're able to better understand why I made that video so long ago basically explaining why I thought that these two would be the anomaly duo for 1.1 and why I still believe that that rings very much true. And I also want to save going into the nuances for the kit when I actually make a guide on both of these characters when they re do release later on in the patch. There's a couple things inside Seth's kit that helps Jane tremendously with building up anomalies such as his faction passive and I want to just kind of showcase that in this video. I want you guys to take note if you are going to watch past this part. I want you guys to take note of how fast Seth builds up the electric anomaly and also how often Disorder procs, like pretty much Disorder is procking consistently throughout this. And without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into the gameplay. Are you guys excited for Seth and Jane? Definitely let me know in the comments uh, whether or not you'll be pulling these two or if you're gonna be saving up for Burnus when she does release or even Caesar when she releases in 1.2. Thank y'all for watching. I will catch y'all in the next video and peace.